evening. Um, thanks for this opportunity to come testify. My name is Zach Trahan, and I work with the Texas Campaign for the Environment. Um, I think that we're here tonight, and pretty much everyone else is here tonight, to clear something up for the TCQ, uh, to kind of clear up confusion. And that is, this plan is supposed to provide clean and healthy and safe and legal air. And right now, the way you have it formed, it does not. Um, close enough is not good enough. And the EPA has already told you this in its comments. Um, and really, we know that through years of experience working on air pollution, water pollution, waste permits, that oftentimes the state environmental agency acts as a rubber stamp for polluting companies. But you should not expect that the EPA will act as a rubber stamp for you in your clean air plan. So the EPA has already told you that your plan does not meet the muster. It does not follow the law. You have a responsibility to follow that law, though. It's not an option to follow the Federal Clean Air Act. And even though the EPA has already told you to make these changes, to actually reduce pollution from major industries like coal plants, cement kilns, oil and gas industry. The plan that you submitted doesn't do that. And so if you won't do it, as many people have already said, that means the EPA will have to do it. And this comes up time and time and time again. And it's really sad that we have to keep coming back to say the same thing. Uh, and it's really sad that refusing to do it, and 20 years later we still don't have air that meets the Federal Clean Air Act requirements. I know there are many people at the TCQ who work in the agency that want to do that. And it's a lot of times the political leadership at the top that won't. But the EPA only is interested in the results. The Federal Clean Air Act is about the result of clean, healthy air for everyone to breathe, period. Not how we got there. So if the only way to do that is to clean up the industries themselves, and the only way to do that is to have the EPA come and write their own federal implementation plan, and so be it. We want the TCQ to do it. We want the state always to follow its responsibilities, to follow its delegation. But if you won't, then well, the EPA is here listening tonight. So thanks very much again for being here. <laughs>